Okay. Thanks for tuning in. This is the CVA Optima V2 50 cal muzzleloader. Um, so first and foremost, I kind of like this gun a lot, honestly. Um, it's just a tad heavier than that Traditions muzzleloader, but that ain't much a big deal. Um, it's very easy to handle and very easy to control and everything, so I do thoroughly enjoy it. Um, now, we'll go with one of the cons from getting the CVA Optima V2. They don't come with two breech plugs. <laughs> I wish they did. I wish they came with a, norm a normal breech plug and a black horn 209 breech plug. I wish they did come with that. Because it took me three weeks to find that, th to find one online. I went to all my local gun stores and everything, could not find one. Checked online, put out a few, uh, notif notify me if when this comes in. And I finally got a uh, notification from Amazon, of all places, that, hey, this product has come available. And uh, was finally able to order that. So that was great. Once I got that in, everything was was good. Um, but yeah, so I use Blackhorn 209. I actually use 80 grains by weight. I reload. I have re reloading equipment. Uh, I follow certain um, charts and everything that is available online at blackhorn209.com. If you ever want to uh, look it up, you can actually just Google Blackhorn 209 and you'll find the website. Um, but yeah, I use 80 grains by weight of that. I get a half inch group at 100 yards with these Hornady board drivers, FTX. It's a 290 grain bullet. And they do some damage. I got me a nice 10 point this year. I'll have it at the end of the video. But yeah, it's... Uh, I can't, I can't complain about this gun at all. The scope it came with is Conus 3 to 9 by 40. It does the job well enough for me. For a Mose loader, that is. So, but yeah. Um, highly recommend it. It does come with spots where you can put some open sights on it if you want to. For now, I'm not wanting to. <laughs> I'll stick to the scope. But, um, yeah. I highly recommend it. It's available. Very enjoyable muzzleloader. And with Blackhorn 209 powder, it is super, super easy to clean. And after you, after the hunt and everything. And can't complain about that either. So, thanks for tuning in. I hope y'all have had or will have a successful deer season. I there's still a month of deer hunting left in my state. I'm Fortunately, next Thursday, it's a big surgery day for me. So, won't be able to enjoy the rest of the season, unfortunately. But, it is what it is. Hopefully next year, I'll be able to do a little, a little bit more hunting. But yeah, so. Anyways, thanks guys for tuning in. See you next time. Here's the some of the hunting pictures from this season. And, got more coming your way.